So most of you are probably already aware of tools like Framer and Webflow, which are no to low code tools for designing and building websites. Now in the last few years, they've really come a long way in terms of the features and you're able to create websites essentially without having to write code. And that's very alluring for people who are just designers who'd rather not to mess with code. The cool thing is about this though, is the websites that you can create with these tools like Framer and Webflow, they are becoming more and more impressive. And it would just a few years ago, it would take a lot of coding with JavaScript and using animation libraries like Greenstock in order to achieve some of the interactive results that you could see now. So with that said, I'm very excited to announce my next course is going to be based on Framer, right? So Framer is one of these low to no code tools and I've covered them in the past, but I'm really gonna start to cover them a lot more so in the next few months while I'm building out this course. So the course is going to be in one of my interactive courses that's gonna be loaded with projects. So I like to teach based on example. So we're gonna start with very simplistic ideas, how to create like a button or a card and how to do all this stuff and design great designs in Figma and then translate them and make them work in the browser and make them highly animated and interactive within Framer. So hopefully you follow along. I'm going to be using Framer actually to build a landing page for my indie hacking AR trainer app. Playlist is right here if you're interested in that. And so I'm gonna be teaching through my own projects as well, teaching Framer that is. So as always, make sure to subscribe if you haven't yet and I'll see you soon with new content. Goodbye.